This month, Scorpio, there's some good news, some not so good news, and plenty of solutions along the way, so stay with me. First, let's talk about the full moon happening on October 16th. It happens in your sixth house of work, and this full moon is next to Uranus, which suggests a sudden change of outcome. Whatever you think is happening, might it might end up being the complete opposite. And I'm talking about a work situation. I, I have to say that for some of you, this might be a job loss. This might be you deciding not to take an assignment if you're freelancing or losing a long-term assignment that you thought was just golden. It can also be the ending of a health problem, a sudden solution, which would be a good thing. But I'm getting the sense that there's a recklessness about this full moon and you might burn a bridge in your work life if you're not careful, especially with a colleague, someone that you work with. So just take that for what it's worth and act accordingly. On October 19th, the Mars and Pluto will connect in a powerful way in your third house. Now, this gives you the courage to speak up for yourself, but your words might come on a bit too strong. You're very powerful now with your words and ideas, but you might be executing them in a way that's intimidating to other people. So be aware of that. If you're directing your words in an empowering way, then you can accomplish something magnificent in the communications arena around October 19th. October 29th is a day that I am concerned for you because Venus and Saturn will link up in your second house of earned income. Now this does suggest a big expense. Money is being spent in a significant way. It's not just a little bill, it's a very big bill. It's something significant and you might be in charge of this. You might be the one executing it. So for example, if you're ready to put money down on a house or buy a car, these are big expenses, but you're asking for it, you want it. So it doesn't have to be a, a horrible expense. It could be one that you've been working towards. But I do see money going out the window at the end of the month, so prepare for that. On October 30th, this is the best news, okay? The month is salvaged for you by the end of the month with a gorgeous new moon in your sign. This new moon is so magnificent that it puts you back in a seat of power almost immediately. There is an opportunity for you to extend yourself in a whole new way. Go out in a completely new direction that feels fulfilling, gratifying, and just all open road. That's what you'll feel by the end of the month. So now that you know, Scorpio, what's in store for you this October, be sure to watch more videos with me right here at Tarot.com.